All right, what's going on, boys and girls? So as the title says, we're going to be looking at something that I have talked about in probably about two years. And that is going to be the BlackBerry Playbook in 20 fucking 20. Is this a still viable option tablet? Yes, with lots of caveats. You have to fit a certain demographic for this. There's no more BlackBerry world, so to speak. So all the paid apps are gone. So where does this sit in 2020 as a useful tablet? Local storage infotainment center for the car. Get a, you know, get a mount for the tablet in your car. Drop this in, Bluetooth to the radio. Hey look, local storage, 64 gigs for $30. Like you can't even get that for a decent head unit. Like a, a decent head unit is gonna cost you anywhere from 100, uh, you know, 150 bucks. Let's not even talk like the Android Auto ones. Um, ebooks. If you have a lot of books from, say, Humble Bundle or Fanatical or any of those kind of websites, this is a great little ebook reading machine. Uh, this is also a great little vlogging machine because with decent lighting, I'm not saying awesome lighting. With decent lighting, you can get fairly good video with this and record exactly what you want. You're only going to be getting about 1080, 30, but for that, that's not bad at all. And I would not complain about that. Um, you know, especially if you're using this like outdoors or something, like this is a really good nice little tablet for recording and you have plenty and the nice thing is you have plenty of space on it the one and you can do wi-fi sharing with these so it makes uh a lot of the syncing with blackberry uh, i think it's blackberry link uh obnoxiously less annoying so you don't have to deal with it uh i use the wireless sharing via lennox and I Wi-Fi shared that way so I can actually access the file browser in this particular tablet. Still the smoothest operating system for a tablet. Still the best multitasking for a uh, you know, mobile OS, hands down. And this thing's nine years fucking old. That's pathetically sad. The only other good OS that was a mobile was WebOS. And that was had its issues because it was never put on like decent hardware. Is this usable? In 20 is the blackberry playbook usable in 2020 yes and no ebooks it's it revolves around a lot of local storage stuff if ebooks local music and that kind of stuff is where you float even even movies 64 gigs for 30 bucks you are gonna get pretty much anything you want on here but on the same note, if you do an, on a lot of online stuff, this might not be the tablet for you. The browser is slow. I mean, you're talking a 2011 tablet. Uh, I believe this is a core, uh, two core, uh, I think it's a Texas Instruments OMAP processor, one gig of RAM. Don't expect a lot. So it's usable. Just kind of if you fit a certain niche. Local storage fans, this is definitely up your alley. For me, still in the playbook, still rocking it, still does what I need it to. So it's gonna keep on, I'm gonna run this thing into the ground. So what do you guys think? Do you guys still like your playbook? Do you guys still use the playbook if you have one? Comment below, let me know. I'll catch you guys on the flip, peace.